This is Bed Brown, Director of Customer Success for IHT. The purpose of this video is to show you how to manage your rosters after they have been uploaded into your IHT account. This screenshot will give you a step-by-step -step instructions on what this video will be about. This video will be in two sections. The first one I will demonstrate and show is moving a student from one group to another that's already in your existing account. The second part of this video will show moving a student from one teacher account to another teacher account. When you do this, it's very important that you make an assessment, then you run a report that includes the participant history. As you open up your IHT account, click on Groups. After you click on Groups, click on the class period that the student is in. After that opens up, you're going to click on the gray tab Participants. Then you're going to look for the student that you would like to move. So now we'll click on a box to the left of that student's name. Then the hyperlink will appear Move Selected to another group. When the next window appears, you will click the arrow down, find the class period that you would like to move the student to, click on that class period, then click Next. After that has taken place, click on Groups just to double check the work. Go back in now to fifth period where you anticipated the new the student to be moved to click on participants the gray tab again and the student should have been moved now from first period to fifth period the second part of this video will demonstrate what to do if you have a student that needs to enter into your grade book from another teacher account so click on groups then click on the class period that you want that student to be entered into. On the next window, click on the gray participant tab. Then the next screen, you're going to click on add new participant or student. Now you need to have the student ID number. Please type in the student ID number, then search by student ID. If you don't have a student ID number, type in last name, first name, date of birth if you have it, and then search by participant or student. The student information will appear then on the right-hand side of the page, and you simply just click on the appropriate student. 